Hello, Take a Break families. Carly Bell here. I hope everyone's having a great week. We got a little glimpse of spring this week, so that was awesome. Um, and once again, Carla and I are going to be celebrating St. Patrick's Day coming up next week, and we're going to be showing you two new activities. So let's follow along. So I'm going to be showing you how to make a clover two different ways with two different objects. All you need is construction paper, green paint, and an apple, and a q-tip or two. That's all. So these don't have to be perfect by any means. I just want everyone to have fun with these while we're celebrating St. Patrick's Day and also working on our fine motor skills while having fun. A benefit in itself. You can also make these as unique as you want. I did three leaf clovers, four leaf clovers, making the stem bigger in some, pushing down the apple. You could also do makes more paint on them. If you wanna do a light stamp on the paint, then you could just do it the apple lightly on the paper. Whatever you wanna do, that's the great thing about this. All right, well, I hope everyone has a great weekend. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Carla and I will see you back here next week. Thank you so much for watching.